Hey everyone, today's tutorial is an eyelash hack. This is something I teach my one-to-one -one clients that struggle with eyelash application and I thought actually it's a really good one to share with you all. This works best with lashes that have got a light band like these ones so that you've got individual sections that you can cut. It can still be done with thicker band forces but you might lose some of the lashes either side of the cut. So I'm just using some nail scissors to cut this into three individual sections. And you want to do this between the lashes and not through the lashes, again otherwise you'll lose some. We're going to start with the outer edge which is the longest part of the lash and we've put a tiny bit of glue on this and we're now going to look down into a mirror and using some tweezers we're going to place this onto the base of our natural lash as close to the root as possible. Use the tweezer for the placement and then use your finger to push the lash downwards and backwards towards the root. This will manipulate the lash to follow your natural lash shape. I didn't wait for the glue to go tacky. The reason for this is I wanna get all three individual sections on before I pinch them with my natural lash. And we don't want the glue to go off before we get a chance to do that. We're now taking the middle section and again, coming in from above our lashes and dropping that into the base of our eyelash. Then we're gonna use our finger to push the lash downwards and back towards the root of the eyelash. Make sure that when you place your lash down, the outer edge meets with the inner edge of the lash sitting next door to it. A little tip is also you can use the back side of your tweezer to press the seam of the eyelash down into the root of your natural lash. You can also see that having just two sections of lashes on my eye is actually enough. I don't need a section on the inside. And I find this with a lot of clients, you don't always need an eyelash to go all the way along your top lash line. So by cutting the lash, you get a choice of how much you want to apply. For the purpose of the tutorial, I am gonna apply the inner edge and I'm doing exactly the same method as before. Doing this method as opposed to applying a whole lash in one go can make it so much easier in getting that eyelash directly to the root of your natural lash. As I mentioned earlier, I didn't allow the glue to go tacky before applying each section, which means we can go in and pinch the lash with our natural lash using a set of long tweezers. This is going to secure that lash band to your natural lashes, pushing the glue in between, and it also means the seam is almost impossible to see. If we had allowed the glue to go tacky, we wouldn't be able to do this because the glue would have already dried, so it wouldn't be doing anything. That's my quick and easy eyelash hack on how to apply false eyelashes. I don't doubt that this is gonna help so many of you. My clients have said it's really made their life so much easier in terms of applying eyelashes because it's such a quick and easy method. If you'd like to learn more on eyelash application, I do have a tutorial on applying individual lashes, strip lashes and bottom lashes. It's on screen for you now. Please subscribe if you haven't already done so and if you'd like to follow me outside of YouTube, my social handles are on screen. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye!